Hello guys and welcome back to Speed to Garage. So most of you ask, uh, why do you rent so much cars? And uh, I'm gonna tell you, I'm an impulsive guy. I'm joking guys, when my truck is in the dealer, uh, I get from the warranty some special, uh, not special days, I get some days to actually uh, rent any type of car I want. And uh, we also have a really good account at uh, our rental agency but anyways guys that is not the point right now I'm in a 2019 Ford Taurus and this is the SEL version of it So the 2019 Ford Taurus is a car that has been around for a while. Um, it has a, a aging platform already. Uh, it shares the same platform as the Ford Explorer. And uh, this car basically comes with 286 horsepower. It's a proven platform. Uh, it has a 3.5 liter V6. This engine is honestly not the most fuel efficient engine. Uh, this engine does around 23 to 24 miles per gallon, uh, which is not the greatest, but it works. What I love about this car is that the ride is super comfortable. Um, you could be driving over tough streets, uh, potholes and everything, and the ride will stay composed all the way. The engine is also plenty of powerful engine transmission uh, six-speed automatic even though it's antiquated because by today's standard uh, everyone has a seven speed eight speed or nine speed or ten speed um, it is pretty good I mean it's a pretty good transmission it gets the job done and I mean there's a reason why police officers uh, choose these vehicles over the chargers sometimes the seats as well they're very supportive on this car uh, we have all leather seats um, they have a couple of adjustments. I think they're four-way or five-way adjustable seats. Um, the uh, armrest is good and padded. The side of the doors are good and padded. So overall, it's a pretty nice space uh, to spend some time on. I mean, the car has uh, power everything, power uh, mirrors, power windows. So it's a really user-friendly car. So like I said, on the left side here, we have a really good padded uh, door handle and trim. Uh, we have our power windows, power mirrors, and power locks. Coming over here, we have our automatic uh, headlights with all the different switches and we have our dimming for the instrument cluster. The steering wheel is pretty good, it feels great uh, to touch. It is leather wrapped for the SEL trim. Uh, we also have the cruise control settings and the volume settings and audio controls. Right here on the center console, we have our SYNC uh, 3, I believe it is. Uh, we also have Wi-Fi wi and hotspot connectivity. Uh, it's pretty low on brightness right now. The sun is hitting it, uh, so I don't know why it's doing that. But uh, moving down over here, we have all, all of our volume controls. Oh, and I forgot the start-stop button. Uh, the temperature controls, climate controls, and a nice uh, leather stitched uh, uh, shifter. We have a nice uh, leather uh, stitched as well uh, center uh, where you put your elbow um, and it's really nice and padded so it's really comfortable and moving over to the right we have this uh, type of brushed uh, plastic aluminum trim kind of it's uh, it looks pretty cheap so I don't like that and this is hard plastic everywhere the so back of this vehicle um, is pretty comfortable these seats are really comfortable this is where these vehicles shine. I mean, look at that ample legroom. 
Uh, these cars are made primarily with the uh, fleet service in mind. So you have uh, taxi services, uh, police services, and uh, many other services that, that use this car as a fleet vehicle. And they are really comfortable uh, cruisers. Over to the back of the vehicle, we have a button right here. Which for some reason is not working. Want to open your trunk, you have to go all the way over here. Press that, come all the way to the back, and now it's over. So yeah guys, back here we have this massive, massive trunk, and we have some 60-folding, uh, exploding, yeah, uh, folding, explode, folding rear seats, um, so you can put cargo all the way to the front, and under this we have our spare tire, and our tools are under the spare tire all right guys i hope you enjoyed this review of the 2019 ford taurus anyways remember to subscribe and hit post notifications for more and if you have any comment or any question on this car go ahead and drop it in the comment box below and i will answer your questions no problem take care garage gang